you think they're gonna be willing to like talk they're probably gonna approach me and be like well, who are you doing this for like we'll pay you double i justice Hostile spotted. show me a little dumb show me some dumb Why don't you pop out, take a look, buddy? <laughs> oh, shit. No scope. I did not no scope. Inaccurate as fuck. Kill him. Did you see that? She unloaded a full clip and didn't hit a single part of his body. What the hell? Prime Lord defeated. Helen was right. These guys had quite the operation going, but that's all going to change. One down, one more to go. Now we got to go to the Hades Gamma Cluster. Or no, wrong. Not the Hades Gamma. The Gemini Sigma. I wonder why these Syndicate people like Snowy Planets so much. Be funny if I was just in the wrong system. Find out real fucking quick though. What these guys are doing in here? What are y'all doing in here? Getting murdered? What a coincidence. I'm here murdered. Fucking sit, sit, kid. Yes, anybody order a bullet to the face? Special delivery, headshots. Guys, that was a clean sweep. You have to admit, that was so clean. That was so fucking clean. Damn. That was a menacing approach. Anything you need, Commander? Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? Is this an official evaluation, Commander? Or off the record? Elenko, when it's just you and me, you can consider it off the record. That's a generous attitude. Okay. I think there's something wrong with all this. This Saren is looking for a lost mass relay to who knows where, but we can't get backup from the Council? Sorry, Commander. There's writing on the wall here, but someone isn't reading it. 
The Council doesn't want to believe anything's wrong. I'd call it human nature, but... I hear you. It, it just seems like a group that's been around as long as the Council should see this coming. Sorry if I got too informal. Protocol wasn't a big focus back in BOT. Tell me about it. Biotic acclimation and temperance didn't last past the airlock. To the kids they hauled in, it was brain camp. Sorry, hauled in is unkind. We were encouraged to commit to an evaluation of our abilities so an understanding of biotics could be compiled. There are worse results of accidental exposure to element zero in the womb. Beats the brain tumors some kids grew up with. Is there some question about how you were exposed? My mother was downwind of a transport crash. It was before there were human biotics, a little after the discovery of the Martian ruins. It only gets iffy around 63 when Kinetics was running out of first-gen subjects. Until then, they'd relied on accidentals. A bunch of guys in suits show up at your door after school, and next thing you know, you're out on Jump Zero. Jump Zero is a okay. long way from home. What was it like? The grand gateway to humanity looks a lot better in the vids. <clears throat> but that's my own baggage, Commander. No bearing on this. Alenko, there's no regulation that says you can't be friends with your commander. I appreciate that, Commander. I just don't want you to think that I'm a, a whiner. Besides, I've got my past squared away. Cool. I think that might have been Anything it. You need, Commander? What's your opinion on the last mission? Killing Saren's, uh, what was Benezzi anyway? Second in command? Advisor? Anyway, it should set him back a bit. I guess we'll be the ones to tell Dr. Tassoni. It's a hell of a thing to drop on her. Any opinion on the Rachni? Off the record? If we had the option, I'd as soon have left it to the Council. We weren't out here during the Rachni War. I'm not sure we have any business getting involved. Yeah, you're right. I do kind of regret my decision on that, but uh, what can I do? Too late now, we live with the consequences of our own actions. We'll talk another time, Lieutenant. Commander? Commander? Yes, Commander? Is there something you need? How well do you know the Lieutenant? I'd never worked with him before this mission, but he has an impressive service record, over a dozen special commendations. Tends to keep to himself, though. Maybe because of the headaches. It's not easy being an L2. What does that have to do with it? Well, most biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Sometimes there are complications. What kind of complications? Severe mental disabilities, insanity, crippling physical pain. There's a long list of horrific side effects. Caden's lucky. He just gets migraines. I should go. Horrific okay. mental disabilities, insanity, all that. But at least you get magic powers. This is gonna get hairy. Oh Hello shit. Hello again, Commander Shepard. I owe you a debt of gratitude. Why do you have a gun? With my former partners dead, this syndicate is now mine. I couldn't How have done did I'm not done yet. Those men deserve to die. Now are we going to have a problem? Not if I can help it, Commander. I hope you can see that I am by far a lesser evil than those men. Under my leadership, this organization will restrict itself to gambling and smuggling illegal technologies. There will be no drugs and no slave-taking for the Batarians. Those days are over. Man, I actually don't give a shit that she's doing, you know, a little bit of crime. But I see... The fu I see the dialogue option, and I like have to do it. That's why I put the points in. This gang has a reputation for drugs and slaving. It's too late to change that. Perhaps you're right. Perhaps this organization has been so tainted by those two idiots that it cannot be redeemed. If I disband the gang, I walk away freely. I have not come so far to be arrested. I would die before going to prison. I would most certainly kill before going to prison. Now, do we have a deal? Sure. You're free to go. I don't ever want to see this gang again. 
If I do... You won't. I'm not so foolish as to break my word to a Spectre. Now, if you'll excuse me, my men become nervous in the presence of law enforcement agents. <laughs> Goodbye, Shepard. Cool. I know y'all in here. Boom! Special delivery. <laughs> Who else fucking wants some? Yeah. LOL. <laughs> oh, well, what do you know? They do. I asked, and then people showed up and said, Yes, we want some. We want this. Please put a gauze around in our face. And I said, Gladly. You know what? I can do that for you. You ask and you shall receive my sweet geth. Bro, dropping them like flaws. Sure, there is some form of aim assist on here, but you guys got to admit, I'm popping headshots like crazy. Think we're good, Commander? You think we're good? Good. If you think we're good, Tally, I think we're good. Ooh, stealthy boy. You've been stealthed. Well. I think I understand how the overload works. 
Oh, there's still one more. Got one more little guy over here. One more little dude. Hey, dumb dumb. Oh, all right. Dude, this place is full of shit. I wonder if there's even anything alive here, because, uh, you yeah, know. All the uh because all the bad guys formed around the ruin after it was built. How would that even work? Volcanic activity maybe? The cavern the volcan like the cave formed around the ruins? Like the material would just need to be so resistant and resi like so resilient that it could handle volcanic activity creating a cave system over top of it, dude? That's pretty mind-boggling. You lead, I'll follow. What are you? Sturdy. <laughs> things don't appear to have like a weak point. wild wonder what kind of crazy shit we're gonna uncover in here can't wait to go tell this chick we killed her mom how convenient it's been here for centuries tens of thousands of years and uh it breaks down when we use it cool to Sony, I presume. Thank the goddess. I did not think anyone would come looking for me. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, all right? We just need to figure some way past this energy field. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Any suggestions on how we can help? There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. Oh. How did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. We have to get you out of here before more Geth arrive. Yes, okay. Right. I've seen enough of them to last a lifetime. That button should shut down my containment field. Oof. <laughs> Max. <laughs> Any idea how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on. Why do I, I, I feel still cannot like... believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit, but I don't know. Uh oh. Something's going down. What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. 
That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. Yeah, we gotta get the we fuck out of here. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. I on the double, mister. <laughs> That's how he knows. On the he double, mister. That's how he knows it, seriously. If I die in here, I'll kill him. <laughs> if I die in here, I'll kill him. You tell him, Rex. You know I'm about to have to fight something. Said something about there being a Krogan. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, he's mean looking. He's not nice and cuddly like Rex. Surrender. Or don't. That would be more fun. In case you didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Thanks for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Hand the doctor over. Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. She'll stay with us, thanks. Not an option. Saren wants her, and he always gets what he wants. Kill them. Spare the Asari if you can. Not, doesn't matter. Okay. I don't know if y'all notice the old, the old fucking uh, one two, the old one two buckle my shoe on the old Krogan Battle Master there. Yeah, guys, that was actually really intense. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds, we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for right, future Green. reference. We almost died out there, and your pilot is making jokes? It's a coping mechanism. You'll get used to it. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those Geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the Conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. How old are you exactly? I hate to admit it, but I am only 106. <laughs> Damn. Only. I hope I look that good when I'm your age. A century may seem like a long time to a short-lived species like yours. But among the Asari, I am barely considered more than a child. Oh, that is well, why that my research weird. has not received the attention it deserves. Because of my youth, other Asari scholars tend to dismiss my theories on what happened to the Protheans. I've got my own theory on why the Protheans disappeared. With all due respect, Commander, I have heard every theory out there. The problem is finding evidence to support them. The Protheans left remarkably little behind. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. Where'd you come up with this theory? I thought there wasn't any evidence. 
I have been working on this for 50 years. I have tracked down every scrap and shred of evidence. Eventually, subtle patterns start to emerge. Patterns that hint at the truth. It is difficult to explain to someone else. I cannot point to one specific thing to prove my case. It is more a feeling derived from a half century of dedicated research. But I know I'm right, and eventually I will be able to prove it. There were other civilizations before the Protheans. This cycle has repeated itself many times over. If the Protheans weren't the first, then who was? I don't know. There is barely any evidence on the Protheans, even less on those who came before them. I cannot prove my theory, but I know I am right. The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. Okay, this isn't helping us find Saren or the Conduit. Ashley, oh, shut the fuck right. up. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit or Saren. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might Why is Ashley such a hater? And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. Great, another alien. No, welcome Good to aboard. Have you on the team, Liara. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? We can talk again after you've seen the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Liera's on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. <laughs> was that really necessary, Shepard? Just disconnect. Man, fuck you haters, dude. The Geth were crawling all over those ruins. We were lucky to make it out alive. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. Yeah, great job, Commander, but except for all this shit, fuck you. 
I'm also sure my crew has some shit to say. But we'll wait to do it. We'll wait to do that. I want to keep the action. Good timing, up. Commander. We got a transmission coming in from the Citadel. Top priority clearance. Is it the Ambassador? It's not his signature. I think it's from the Council. I'll patch it through to the Comrade. Okay, then. Commander Shepard, we've received information that may be critical to your mission against Saren. What up, Luke? He's got that thousand yard stare. They all do, dude. They all do. They've seen some shit. I'll take all the help I can get. We've received an urgent message from one of our infiltration regiments in the Traverse. You mean spies? Spectres tend to attract attention, Commander, but they are only one arm of the Council. Special task groups are often a better option for monitoring developing situations. We currently have several infiltration units scattered throughout the border regions of Citadel space. This particular unit was gathering intel on Saren. What did they find? Unfortunately, the message we received was little more than static. The infiltration team must be in a situation where they can't set up proper interstellar communications. But the message was sent on a channel reserved for mission critical communications. Whatever they were trying to tell us, we know it was important. Considering your interest in Saren, we thought you might want to investigate this. Find out what happened to our team. The signal originated from the planet Vermeer. I'll look into it. The Council prefers not to become involved in the specifics of Spectre activities. We only want you to be aware of all your options, including Vermeer. Good luck, Commander Shepard. <clears throat> we will keep you advised if we learn anything else. Thanks. 